good mall. It's going down. Tonight's gonna be a good, good night. First of all, let's go. Gems, it's Cameron Shanima, and we are back at it again with another mother freaking vlog, baby. Another mother freaking vlog. Another mother freaking vlog. <laughs> um, I am getting ready to head to the gym now. Um, I'm doing upper body today. I'm not going swimming because I am booked and busy, baby. I have a lot of work to do today, so I'm just gonna and do this workout oh let me tell you what happened yesterday <laughs> oh my god so yesterday i went to the gym and i was doing leg day um and i was on the chest press um not the chest press i'm sorry the leg press machine so it's when you're like laying like that head like see <laughs> I'll put in a visual, but like, it's when you're like using your legs to press up on the weight like this to like work on your quads and stuff. Baby, why did I fart while I was on the machine? And I felt homeboy next to me, look at me. And I was like, somebody said something? <laughs> it was so embarrassing, like, dang. My bad, y'all. I really went to the gym to be a pooty butt. Like, oh my god, and that was like my worst nightmare. Like, oh my god, I just knew what's gonna happen to me. I just knew because something about them damn machines make you always want to poop. I don't want to poop. Oh my child, and it escapes me without my permission. Child, it caught me by surprise, too. I said, Oh, that was me, <laughs> oh my god. and it was spicy, like, it wasn't like super loud, but it was like. We we know what you did, sis. Child, when I said I, I didn't make no eye contact, I just stood on the machine. I went on my phone. I started tweeting about my distress and I said one thing about me and Mac like nothing happened. <laughs> but I was like, this is so embarrassing. I pulled it at the gym, y'all. So I said, how am I supposed to go back to that gym? How? 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 Um, so I'm going to a different gym today. <laughs> this is embarrassing i'm so embarrassed oh my gosh like when i tell y'all my worst nightmare because the way i be having to clench my cheeks to keep the poop inside like why why do i always need to poop on the machine oh my gosh y'all it's so annoying you know it's so embarrassing like dang and you know you when you poop, especially when you're a big girl. Like when you're bigger, there's just certain things that look worse on you because you know people are just like, she probably had a burger and came over here and put it all over the. Oh my god! I mean, I would have shoot a burger sound real good right now. It was so embarrassing. Uh, so yeah, I had to come and share my story with y'all. But anyways. I'm not going nowhere near the leg press machine. You know what? I think I'm good off the leg press. Like, forget these quads. Forget these leg gains. Forget the, like, I'm going to have me some weak legs and a strong upper body because I'm only doing upper body from now on. Some about them leg workouts always make me want to poop. Pooty head ass. Booky butt head ass. Dang. That was so embarrassing. <laughs> Oh my gosh, but yeah, so y'all, I kept pressing the heck out of my snooze button um, this morning. I haven't made my bed all week. I said all week, girl, it's been one day. But still, actually, I haven't been making my bed even last week. Like, oh, I need to get my life together, okay? Because I am not at my peak performance right now, and it is impacting my life. So, anyways, I'm about to get this workout in. Hopefully, I'll poop today and ban myself from this gym. Um, but yeah, I'll talk to y'all later. <laughs> Pooty gang, gang, gang. <laughs> All right, y'all. I just arrived. So, 
so her rep for the gym. Weak AF of her body. Let me hit myself, sis. So give me a little boost inside. Mm. This is the peach mango green tea. It says it's good for essential energy, accelerates metabolism, and burns body fat. Zero sugar. And that's all the great stuff. All right, let's go. their super green or super veggie mix i used to have it all the time in college when i was at maryland oh my god i used to have it all the time with the chili sauce oh it was good i tried their angus steak um entree i'm not a fan but the teriyaki chicken is always a faithful go-to but um yeah i definitely get something else next time that steak it was the texture was just weird like why is steak so like soft That was weird. <laughs> but yeah, overall, it was a nice lunch. lunch. Yo, y'all, it's like y'all, you ever eat and you feel like you didn't eat nothing? Like, my stomach feels completely empty. <laughs> like, I legit just had, I mean, I guess I could have had the rice. I feel like the last time I had the rice there, I didn't really like it. I don't remember. It has been a while since I had the brown rice. But, oh, maybe I should have gotten it. I just really wanted the vegetables, y'all. They, they be so crispity. Oh my god, bro, that broccoli be. Mm. I was like, dang, did I eat? But then I had like two protein entrees, so I don't know. I'm gonna just chill out. I might have a protein shake a little later on. Um, drink some water and see that I'm filling the gaps in my stomach. Why am I so hungry? Oh, it's giving leg day hunger. the evening um i had to film some content but i had plans to go out tonight with my friend and this is the second week in a row where we're just like i mean we can go out but like we don't have to go out <laughs> last week i thought like we were both like dead tired and so it's kind of like you don't want to cancel you don't want to be a flake but it's also like you know if you're really not feeling it it's fine with me too and we just kept doing that back and forth and finally we're just like all right We'll go next week. And so, same thing happened again today. And, um, I mean, I was, I, I'm very tired. I'm not gonna lie. I'm very tired. Um, but I was like, you know what? I'll just go. 
I'll get outside, you know? And she was like, I don't have no wig on, but I, I throw on a scarf. And I said, oh, that's just telling me, listen, <laughs> we can go, but we really don't have to go. <laughs> so I said, all right, sis, it's all right. We're going to reschedule. <laughs> I'm so dead. Child. Ooh. Um, but anyways, I decluttered. Well, not decluttered, but I got rid of a couple bags to make space for the ones I just added. Um, I'm not sure when you guys will see this vlog or when you'll see the content. So I'll just until then. But I do have some new babies that I cannot wait to wear out. And I got rid of some older bags that I had that I haven't been wearing. So I'm like, if I haven't worn it in the past two years, three years, you can let it go. You can let it go. Um, but a couple of them I didn't want to let go because I was like, oh, you know, I don't have this color. I don't have this. I don't have that. Um... But it's like, sis, you had this color and you never wore it. You know, the one time you actually wear something that, need that, that needs that color, like, you'll find another bag to go with it. <laughs> so I said, let me go ahead and let it go. So, I, like, my new Poshmark palette is growing. Um, I have a friend that modeled for us last time. Ugh, lifesaver. Y'all don't understand how tiring these hauls are, bro. They are tiring. And you think, like, you're just putting clothes on. You think that that would be nothing, right? Like, even saying it a lot, I'm like, I sound ridiculous, but they're honestly tiring. Um, and so I'm just like, the idea of having to put on clothes again for Poshmark. And a lot of the clothes, I mean, I go through clothes frequently because of the type of work. I mean, clearly I'm doing hauls all the time. But also, I sell clothes that are too small, that don't fit me well, that, that you know, this or that. So for me to model them, it's... Mm, probably not the best <laughs> um and then Tyree you know how hard it is to to sh shimmy into a bandage dress like why y'all trying to give me more work I'm trying to lessen my work I'm trying to delegate more work okay not put more work on myself child I know some people have suggested you know like wearing the clothes and showing it like that and that's a great idea it really is but when I think about the physical labor I'm just like So um, I need to schedule some time with my, my sis to come and um, put on the clothes for you guys. So you can take pictures and you can post those. Child, when I say my bathroom has literally turned into storage, it's actually not funny. It's probably a fire hazard. It's actually not funny. But in the next couple of months, I think there'll be some, some changes to help, you know, facilitate um the Poshmark process so I'm looking forward to that um but yeah I ordered some Chick-fil-a and I'm about to eat good I'm not gonna hold y'all I'm about to eat good 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 you know what I mean a good it want a good 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 hey you know what I want a good 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 I don't ever know the worst of songs it's actually appalling but um yeah I ordered a grilled chicken club mm extra fries in a salad period okay so i'm like i'm hungry i had see that's my, my problem this is my problem um i'll be too lazy to cook full meals that's really my biggest problem and then i'm starving and when i'm starving that's how i get here binging and i'm going what I'm going to binge, okay? I'm a what? I'm going to eat, all right? I'm looking forward mm, to that Chick-fil-A sauce, baby. The way I'm about to uh, drown these fries in the Chick-fil-A. Mm. Baby, listen, listen. If I say that damn listen song one more time, child. But I'm like, all I had today was like vegetables and like shrimp. And I had some chicken. I stopped by Panda Express. They didn't have brown rice. And I wasn't really in the mood for, for white rice or anything. <clears throat> anything like that oh the throat is dry oh the throat is dry damn I drink all my sparkling water I need to go get my water water but yeah so I, I just got that uh, I mean I really love their mixed vegetables though like for real I really love their mix they're super super veggie super fruit super food I don't know what they call it but it's I thought be cri I love me some crispy broccoli bro like it's actually an obsession I really love crispy broccoli. Anyways, I had that earlier. Then I got home. Um, I had some leftover 
kale and shrimp mix that I made. A cute little mix. I had that. Then I went to work. Um, and now I'm like, I'm ready for some real food. Like, that was cute. It was good. But it's not filling enough. And I'm starving. Period. Okay. Okay. Um. Oh, hello, Brandon. Where's Cassie? Uh, not here. Can I help you? Oh, I don't know how. Uh, I have a slight pain right here. Oh, wait, no. Actually, now it's over here. Well, wherever it is, Cassie always seems to know exactly what I need to cure what ails me. You should try some spearmint tea. Well, now, how on earth would you know something like that? Well, I lived with Cassie while she was married to my dad. Of course, your family. <laughs> I can go fill you up a bag if you want to keep shopping. Well, I am a bit of a browser. <laughs> mm. <clears throat> oh! I know. That's weird, huh? Well, I just don't know what you would use all these spaces for. As near as I can tell, that thing was made to hold shampoo bottles and, I don't know, shoelaces? <laughs> Cassie's had that box sitting here forever, but nobody wants it. And neither do I. Oh, look, there's Brandon with my bag of tea. You know what? I'm feeling better already. <laughs> Dad. Well, you were, but it got kind of embarrassing. I was beating him so much, so I'm giving him some time to practice until it's a fair fight. Oh, I don't have a. <laughs> mm. Um, I got unsweetened tea in lemonade, and it's the perfect amount of sweetness. Not too sweet, not too bitter. Mm. Perfection. I was watching Good Witch. Y'all, this show is so corny, but I'm on season four. Why? 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 Um, but anyways, I need to bleach my hair. I need to bleach my hair because I'm getting my hair cut tomorrow. Um, at this point, I look and want to push it. Like, I'm about to just. Actually, I really might push it. Just have them fade out the sides. I think I really might do that. I do not want to bleach my hair. I don't. I don't. I don't. I don't. I don't. Oh my God. Did I just decide? But I love freshly bleached hair. <laughs> uh, I really do need to do it, but that's okay. I have to bleach it next week anyways. Because next week is my birthday. Birthday. Oh, shoot. I just I wanted to take a birthday picture for the gram. But my hair's not done. I'm not going to take it. It is what it is. I've already decided. My mind's made up. I'm not bleaching my hair tonight. I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm very tired. Okay, y'all. I crushed that Chick Fil A. Baby crushed. I'm gonna save the salad for tomorrow, though. Oh, the last time I had their salad, it was so freaking good. Um, crush the salad. Crush the drink. Now I'm about to just do some light cleaning up and go to bed. I'm so, I need to go to bed. Hey y'all. <laughs> oh my, I sound like Dina. Hey y'all. <laughs> um, I'm on my way to get my hair cut and get my nails done. Cause it, it, is, it is about time, honey. Ooh, I am getting a new set. Y'all, it's, no, it's the same old, same old, food. same old, same old. But I think I'm going back to rectangle. This was cute, it was a vibe but I'm going back to short. <laughs> and I feel like, okay, so y'all know I have a bad toe, right? Can I tell you that a story of how I broke my big toe, my right big toe? It ain't been right since, yo. So while well, I'm not saying it ain't been right, because at one point it was thriving. I mean, the, the toenail fell off, it grew back. It was real, mm, I mean, no, it ain't been right since, I'm lying. But it got to a decent place. But then 
it's been acting weird the past year and a half or so like it's almost like the nail isn't connected to the nail bed all the way so like the top left corner does not attach to my skin so it's like i can literally like put my hand i probably sound really gross but i can like put my nail underneath it and i just i don't know like it just hasn't been right and it's getting worse so i'm just like bro and then i was watching gina janine's vlog and she was talking about how somebody that she knows their toenail fell off out of nowhere and she was like her toenail fell off too and they're suspecting that it was because of the gel polish like apparently gel polish makes your nails weak or something like that and i was like yo like maybe that would explain why all of a sudden my nail just stopped attaching to the nail bed again because it was weird it was like the toenail fell off but then it grew back and then it was fine i mean it, the actual nail and stuff is ugly but that's what polish is for so it was fine and then it just stopped sticking to the nail bed and then i was looking at it and it was like it's kind of like cracked now so i don't know y'all something going on my toe and i'm like damn if you gonna fall off again like don't wait till summer do it now because it just looks so i'm like dang y'all i really like getting gel polish on my toes because i like that it's dry that's literally the only reason why well, I had gel polish on my toes because it's dry right then and there. I feel like no matter how long I wait after I get my toes done with regular polish, I always end up smudging it. And it's winter time, so who wants to be wearing flip flops and stuff? So I was just like, dang, like, is that really like the cause? And I tried to do some Googling to research to see what that was about, but people were saying, oh, you know, that's not a thing. Why would gel make your toes? fall out or whatever and i'm just like i don't know child but i'm like bombs because it's, it's like cracked now like right on the side um so like you know the edge of the nail that sticks into that, that little fold that part is still there like a slither and then there's a crack between that and the real nail so i'm about to tell my nail tech like so be real careful <laughs> be real real careful with this toe okay job um but yes yeah, so i'm just like i want to have pretty feet so bad <laughs> but i don't i have the worst traits between my father and my mother with their toes like i have my father's toenails and my mom's toes and her toes are spaced out i'm like why can't my toes be like this like everybody else's why does it have to be like this why gotta be like this so I've been wearing heels and my toes literally look like this. <laughs> so they look like this. <laughs> my toes be gripping the heck out the child. But I mean, it is, it, it is what it is. You know, I can't be, everything about me can't be perfect. I cannot be perfect. So I guess, God was, I'm gonna give her this one little imperfection, keep her humble. Any, any. <laughs> I am driving. Get my hair cut and get my nails done and then go back home and get some work done and go out for Uga. <laughs> I am linking up with someone tonight for the first time, so I'm a little anxious about that because you know I can be weird sometimes. And people are always surprised when I say that, like, oh my god, would you see it's how I'm going and stuff? So this is that. So I'm talking to a camera by myself. Uh, ain't nobody around. And I can edit out all, edit, um, you see what I'm talking about? I can edit out all the awkward parts. So y'all don't know for real. Like, I'm talking in a car by myself. And everybody else I talk to on here is people that I've known for years. Like, you, like, you know, my, my road dogs, my homeboys, my homegirls. Like, these my folks. They know my awkwardness already. When we meet somebody new, it's a new exchange of energy. Okay. Mm. It's new. And then with the panoramic, I don't keep, uh, you know, it's not often that I meet new people. And so my, my conversational skills are subpar. See, I don't like how you just try to cut in front of me like that. Like, I really don't like that. But I'm gonna let it pass. I'm gonna let it pass. But, um, yeah, so my, my uh, conversational skills have definitely suffered. And it's panoramic, okay. So I'm hoping tonight isn't super awkward, um, but I am excited.
excited and looking forward to going out. So I just decided to go out yesterday. Oh, oh, oh. All right, that's my sign, y'all. I'll talk to y'all later. Because I don't care. I don't give a damn. I don't give a shit. Up. to head out now I have like 20 minutes to throw on a quick face and get the hell out <laughs> um y'all my stomach was rocking a little bit um, chat. um I don't know if you guys remember this top from my was it my boot haul oh I'm obsessed oh my god I'm obsessed I'm obsessed I'm obsessed so when I was rocking it in the boot haul I left it as is and just belted it but today I'm going to crop it and wear it like that. Does this look weird? It might look a little weird, but <laughs> it probably does look a little weird because <laughs> it's so big. But I am obsessed with it. I'm just going to look weird because I, I don't care. I really don't care. Like, I genuinely do not care. 
<laughs> the back is so big. Maybe I should look to see if I can get a smaller size or get like my actual size in this. I mean, that looks better. When I tell y'all I am obsessed with this top, I'm gonna, gonna retie this because I want the front to hang a specific way. So, just did a knot. Look at the There we go. Yeah. Actually, let me do that again so y'all can see. So, I literally just like tied it in a knot. Okay? Then you do it again. But before you tighten it, you kind of just turn it. You kind of fix it up a little bit. And make it pretty. Okay, it looks a little ugly now, but whatever. And then you kind of like shape it. And get it to hang how you want it to. It's a little hack. When do I ever have this much material in front of a shirt? Like. Shout out to Pretty Little Thing, baby, for making me a pretty little thing. Yes. Wow. It's so hard for me to ever find a real oversized shirt. I can't believe it. Like, this shirt is actually too big for me. Oversized. <laughs> Baffling. Um, I'm going to wear my Blondo boots. Uh, the pants are from Torrid. Let me um, throw on a quick face. I don't got to lotion my feet because I'm wearing boots. <laughs> Listen, anything that will save me time right now. Because one thing about me, I hate being late. I hate being late, especially your first time meeting somebody. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. And I'm meeting in D.C. And I do not want to do with parking. So I'm about to Uber. I probably shouldn't, but the parking situation over there is just not the best. So I really want to wear silver, but the hardware on the boots are gold, so gold it is. <laughs> All right. And then I picked up, oh, I finally got the new primer from e.l.f., so I'm going to go ahead and try that. I don't know why I would do that, but, you know, YOLO. <laughs> A real quick, simple face. Um, Two play bonus way child get me right every time. Gets me right every time. Okay, it's passing test number one. It will layer as well with the Becca Mattifying Concealer, not concealer primer. Okay. Oh. Okay. Oh, is that boogers? Oh my god. Yuck. Yuck, yuck, yuck. Hold, please. Ah! Oh my god, I forgot to show you guys my nails. I'm tripping. Y'all, I like the dip powder. At first, I was like, mm, I don't know if I'm gonna do the dip because I need my nails to have like some strength to them because they break very easily. But they're like a thin acrylic. You know, not like super hard, but it's like, if you're careful, you're fine, you know? So I am a fan. Oh my God. Am I a dip powder girl? And I did the regular polish on my toes. So I'm going to do it for a couple sessions and then see if my nail will heal. Because <sighs> right now things are not looking good, okay? Things are just not... Mm. It's not looking good. But, um, Too Faced, boy, okay. Last time I almost used the wrong foundation base. Girl, I almost used my contour shade. I'm like, you know what? <laughs> Shout out. Get your life, Jamima. Get your life. All right, y'all. I feel like I need this to be open because I don't want to get makeup on this. Ooh, child. Um, because I don't know if we're like, eating, so I wanted to have a little something before I left. Cause I'm like, child, we're not eating. I don't want to be the one greedy, Joe. <laughs> I mean, I am. 
I'll say that like that's gonna stop me. But I mean, I would be the greedy jump. I don't really want to be the greedy jump. I don't have to be, you know. Um. But yeah, I am looking forward. I haven't had hookah in a minute. I'm just looking forward to being out. Like, and I'm sleeping in tomorrow. I've already decided. Uh, I need to hit up camera. We're supposed to do a photo shoot. I told her 11. Um, I kind of want to push it back so I can sleep in before I start prepping. Um, okay, the skin is skinning. Yes, come on. Mm. Well, let me call Kim. Let me make sure that she's pushing it to like a one or something. <laughs> she texted me what time. See, this is what I'm talking about. Text me talking about what time tomorrow. We had already agreed on a time. That's all right, though. The live same one. <laughs> I know she's not, not picking up. Rude. <laughs> usual Laura Mercier under the eyes y'all makeup forever has a new foundation and I'm like um I need to try that <laughs> I need to try that ASAP oh my god y'all I missed my short nails wow I missed her um she was trying to convince me to not do white again <laughs> But I was like, I just like what I like, sis. My birthday's gonna come up. I, I would hate for me to do something and hate it on my birthday, you know? I'm very particular about my nails. My nails can really, like, put me in a bad mood. And I don't know why. Like, if I wear my nails, I might actually cry. Like, real tears. Something about my nails just, I don't know what makes me so sensitive and emotional. But I don't know what it is, y'all. Like, but not liking my nails can actually make real tears fall down my eyes. Mind you, I've had terrible haircuts from barbers who didn't know what they're doing. Messed up my hairline. Completely effed up my hairline. You know, I'm just like, really? Like, but my nails? <laughs> and just be in a really crappy mood. Oh, my God. Like, so I'm like, sis, do my white, please. But then the polish that she was using between the dip powder, because this is my first time getting dip powder. I'm like, it's literally powder that you dip your finger in <laughs> i was like not y'all being so literal <laughs> i thought it was gonna be something like they like i don't know what i thought i mean acrylic is a powder too don't call it dip acrylic i was like you're literally dipping my finger in the powder first of all this doesn't look sanitary <laughs> i was like mm, i don't think this is clean and it's koro koro <laughs> I said, I don't think this is it. Mm -mm. But I said, you know what? I'm going to trust the process. Try it out. And if I hate it, I'll just get my nails done again next week. Right before my birthday. But I like it. I like it. I'm glad I thugged it out. Glad I stuck it out. Um, and that might be, you know, my new jam. For short nails, though. I don't know if they're strong enough to handle long nails. But, like, I did natural overlay, like, over my nail. And I'm like, you know, I... I'm walking with this. Hold on, y'all. Kim's calling. Hey, girl. Hey. Oh, you made the smoothie? Oh, the, I'm vlogging, by the way. Girl, um, it's a little different. I'm missing ingredients. What did you put in it? Um, I put the coconut water. I put turmeric. I put the tropical blend. Frozen uh, fruit. Mm-hmm. And I put, um, well, I didn't want to open a new bag of spinach I bought, so I have a spinach and kale. So I put, like, 50 million scoops oh, of that. Oh, that's going to make a difference. Kale has a stronger flavor than spinach. Yeah, but, it, girl, I need it. I need all of it. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I would actually prefer spinach. a spinach I and kale mix. I want your I want you to chill with the big boys in my stomach. I mean, is it still good, though? Yeah, it's still good. Yeah, it's still good. Yeah, and push them out. You know what? Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to push them out. 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 I'm going to <sighs> My stomach is pressing against these pants, child. Where are you going? 
Um, Gazuza. Mm. Okay, well, you know, we have a new uh, place that we can attend. Okay, we'll be taking the American stuff. And not, no, there's no after beast. Mm. It's giving society. I don't know, it might give a little, it might, something might shake. It's new. I'm trying to hear you want the bum up? <laughs> you want to chill with the big boys? Oh, Lord. I'm trying to hear some freaking vibes cartel. Mm. Oh, yeah. Um, we never established a time tomorrow. We That's did, time. but I wanted to change it. What time did we say? 11. Oh, shit. I forgot. <laughs> <laughs> I'm weak. But I was like, can we do one? I want to sleep in tomorrow. Okay. I don't know what your schedule looking like. I don't really have a schedule. I just got to... Um... I'm gonna do gym in the morning. Oh, I'm glad I didn't call that Uber. Better say. Alright, so this is the final look. Jewelry or necklaces by Navea. Earrings are in the apology. I feel like they're super cute. Um, ring by somebody told me about this brand in my Hanifa video. Shoot. Oh darn it, what is it called? It's um Ah you know, that's... Atomic Gold? Atomic Gold? But y'all, I find I have real jewelry, y'all. Solid gold. And it was like affordable. But that, it's like these fine pieces. Like I have this one. And I got my name. Ooh, chow. Oh, the ash. Disrespectful. And I also had this one with the J on it. <laughs> Jamima, period. Uh, Nevea. Movement. Um, And that's it. I'm going to put my boots on last. So she texted and said she's gonna be here. Well, be there at 8:45. So that gives me a little bit more wiggle room. I kind of want a ring on this finger. Yeah, I feel like a new person in my short nails. Mm, must be nice. Must be nice. Get out of someone who loves you despite your faults. Must be nice. That's someone who. But also walk the wall. I don't want to understand that a dog has feelings too. Someone who loves you for sure. You never let him go. Girl, I, I don't know. Child, this was so suspect. But they be smelling so good. What is that? This guy was selling these little oils out his man purse. I'm like, I know he made this in a basement somewhere. And he done put this on everybody's arm. But I... I I would do it again. I love these. <laughs> I would do it again. No labels, no nothing. Just vibes. <laughs> Saying they're soliciting people. And at first I was like, oh, okay. I support my young black king. But then I'm like, dang. He looks at my beat up <laughs> Child, this might be canola oil. I don't know, but I need it in my life. Girl, I don't know what I'm going to hear. Ain't nobody going to smell it. <laughs> my waterboard somebody at the bar. <laughs> at the bar. Are you rolling in between your titties? I don't know why I did that, sis. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, but what that heat gonna do is help project that that fragrance yeah. mixed with my <laughs> pheromones. But if the fragrance is not there, it's gonna be there. I just put it on there. No, but if you didn't put it on there, my pheromones are good enough on its own. It be your own. Haters gonna hate, and players are gonna play. 
All us are gonna fall. Shot callers are gonna call. <laughs> With me and you. <laughs> mm. I'm saying, I wanna know what fragrance this is. I think he does imitation perfumes because he was trying to get me to try this Chanel one. I was like, I don't really like Chanel perfumes. There's like one. I like Chanel Chance. But I, I personally found that it didn't last long on my skin. I don't really have that issue with fragrances. They usually last pretty long on me. So I don't know if I just thought it didn't last long. Because sometimes you wear a fragrance and you don't smell it on yourself, but other people still smell it on you. So I'm thinking maybe that was the case. I don't know. Anyways, what am I talking about? Oh, girl, I got his IG though. So I might write him on my Finsta and be like, yo, what's up? Like, I met you at the mall. You have more of these. Leave me in the trash. What's going down? Leave me in the mall. What's going down? Anyway, meet me here, keep it going down. Niggas in my face, riding every day. Something, 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 job where we stay. In College Park. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I don't know nothing else. Ha, that's gonna be the uh, intro clip. <laughs> All right. Hey guys, so these um, let me let me do outfit uh, outfit of night. Um, guys, um, Kim wanna be an influencer so bad. So Kim, just take the leap. Just name. take the leap. The face beat is by Miss <sighs> Me Ma Miss Jamima Brother. <laughs> the outfit. The, top, <laughs> the Corona. I don't know. The leggings are from, I don't know, and the shoes, I don't know. Um, and this body, hmm. Okay. My auntie. Okay. My body. My, my, my. Built from God. Okay. My auntie. What is it? Big body pants. Remember, I used to be dusty. Huh. What? Get into it. Who used to be dusty? Act like you know. If you, if you, if you go back to the Act first like video you know. that Jamima ever posted on on. on Wow. It's still available. It's the hate for me. Act like you know. I, not that right I'm finna die. All right, that's my cue. I need to go anyways. I'm finna go and sit at a bar and wait for her. Toodaloo. See you on my travels. My phone is, well, my work phone is charging right now. Well, actually, no, it's not because Kim is rapping on it. First of all, let's go. Like they sure do. They knew we were coming. What's your vlog style like? I just talk shit. Hey. Oh, that's my entire channel. Okay. That's my brand. Yeah, I know. <laughs> 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 
Uh -huh, they know shambles. Hey, look how DC's getting bougie. Blue Mercury in DC. Listen. I can't. I can't. I can't. You know, they blocked off this whole trip. Can you recognize that? I feel like, did I come here before? Oh. We're at this place called Mission. It's really beautiful. It looks a little bougie, but hey. I put on a. <laughs> All right, y'all. What is this shirt? Is disrespecting me right now? You know what? Give him a fashion um, tour. Oh, hold on. I'll hold it for you. Oh, okay. thank you. Look at the fit. Can I do it right? Hold on. Sorry to your editor, but we needed the full. <laughs> we needed the full moment. <laughs> yes. Fit fucking <laughs> shoes. Oh, I'm sorry, cause everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't even know what those are. The vlogs watching the vlogs. The vlogs. In the <laughs> interception. Yo. Yo. Guys, it's bedazzled. Oh no, she used to be extra. I used to have pink seat covers. Oh. Like it was really extra. Was really oh, extra. I love it. Yeah. Oh my god. Can you really not go around a circle? No, that's crazy. They're really just trying to. I don't know. It's actually psycho. Right, this is going to be loud in the vlog. I'm going to head in. Man, my damn man, I'm gonna be man. <laughs> here, you want light? I know, you need a ring light. I used to have a full light right here that was like a ring light. Uh-huh. This flame put it died and I never charged it. Oh, <laughs> you know what? <laughs> never charged it, girl. <laughs> I just got to charge it. Unless never like that. Mm -hmm. Have you ever shot that loft? No, that's not like skinny people clothes. <laughs> no, no, actually they, they do have, um, wait, is it loft that I'm thinking about? No, it's not like it's for me. That would be loud and wrong. I might be uh, Google that. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I might be remembering something else. And I, uh... I like to be loud and wrong. It's fun. Y'all, it was an event. Oh my today. girl, now he's creating a whole new traffic oh, pattern. Yeah, because he's like, this is dumb. Maybe ah. something going on over there. Not traffic pattern. All right, y'all. Good night. Oh, he's completing a trip. Good oh, good night. Toodaloo. Yes. <laughs> Good morning, y'all. Um, so I'm getting ready to head out, hit the streets with y'all's friend. Um, we're going to Marshall's, and then we'll see how I feel after that. Cause I have some returns, but we'll see. I need to finish my laundry. I have boxes to take out. Lord, it's always something. Very much something. I need to be careful, so I'll show y'all my address. Ain't nobody pulling up on me.
from Eloquy. Jeans are Torrid. Shoes are Puma via a uh, motherfucking Ross. <laughs> Ross. Ricky Rose Ross. <sighs> Bro, bidding over is ghetto. I'm tired of having to do it. Work. Je suis dans les laries. Merci beaucoup. Passez bonne journée. Yeah. yeah. Side, but um the car next to us that was parked here earlier hit kim's freaking car and it rolled out and then no 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 nothing hey i hope you motherfuckers watching this video you know what the hell you did let's hit it and do it <laughs> not ice cream Oh, so annoying. Not for real.
<sighs> y'all, I'm back. Yo, do you see how I had to wrap myself up? It is so windy outside. And of course, the, the, the second I forgot to wrap my head, my hat went flying. Ooh, Chile. Ah. <laughs> Bruh, ain't nothing worse than having to run in front of people. Girls, run after that damn hat. Like, Lord, let me catch it before it flies again. <laughs> but yeah, so. <coughs> oh my God. We went to Trader Joe's and I was like, you know what? Cause Kim went to get the, the Zoog sauce that I showed her the other day. Um, and I was like, why are we here? Let me go ahead and do this grocery for the rest of the week. <laughs> Shoot, so I don't have to do an Amazon Fresh order. Um, which I'm probably still going to anyways, but you know. So. <sighs> Let me bring my groceries to the kitchen. Where's my house slippers? Hold on. We're going to do a little grocery haul, okay? Purr. Purr. Hold on. <laughs> so good. So good. Um, I also ordered the ISO 100 hydrolyzed protein powder um, and cookies and cream because Kim said this one is so good. So we're going to see. Y'all know I try to do the plant-based protein. I go back and forth because <laughs> the plant-based, like the ones I've found so far, they're good for what they are. But like these protein shakes are just fire, period. Okay. I'm waiting for the day that there is a plant protein that tastes like a regular protein shake. But for now, we're going to go back and forth between the two. <laughs> so I can't wait to try this one. She said it tastes like a damn milkshake, y'all. So we're going to see. 25 grams of protein, 110 calories, 2 grams of carb. Girl, I don't care about it. Protein. Fire tastes good. All right. Um, Trey Ajaz. A, a Trey Ajaz. Um, so I actually wanted to marinate. Do that today or tomorrow? I'm gonna do it tomorrow. Cause I kinda bought, well, <laughs> so as you guys saw, we stopped to get food to eat, but that wasn't the plan. So I had already, oh shoot, the sauce is dripping. Oh brother. But um. My plan was to heat up this pizza that I bought, which I really shouldn't have. Cause it's freaking cheese, but it's roasted garlic and pesto pizza. Like, look at this! Oh my gosh! Oh, I said nah. I gotta, I gotta take a little L for this one. This looks so good. It says with four Italian cheeses, cashew and pine nut pesto, and a chewy Naples style crust. Ooh. So I don't know. I guess I, I could have this tonight, but I'm not sure. We shall see. Um. I bought some more spinach for my shakes and also to cook with. Bought two of those. Um, I bought more of the chicken cilantro mini wontons. I actually found out about these from Aaliyah's Faces channel. These are actually really freaking good. And so I think I just want to start keeping a bag of these in stock in my freezer at all times. Because I feel like when you want a snack, like you don't want a whole meal, but you don't want like a snack that's not gonna do anything for you. So I feel like these are really good for that in-between snack when you still want to feel fulfilled and satiated. Satiated? Mm. Um, but yeah, so got that. And I also got, oh, this is for Kim. She got root vegetable fries. Oh, it's mine now. Oh, what? oh. Uh. Yeah, it's mine now. Roasted sweet potatoes, carrots, beets, and parsnips. Oh, you put them in air fryer? This is actually like really good. Ooh. Uh, thank you, Kim. <laughs> it's mine now. <laughs> oh, she's gonna be sick. Oh my gosh. I got some uh, organic chicken wing sections. Um, whenever I want to make my little chicken wings. Uh, also, anytime chicken wings come in this kind of bag, I'm kind of like, mm, something about this is just not. Let me look at these ingredients. They just put extra stuff in it. Okay, so Trader Joe's doesn't put anything extra in this. You be reading ingredients, maybe by chicken, 
citric acid, blah, 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 blah. Give me the chicken. Just give me the chicken. So, okay, I'm not going to have that issue with this. So, at some point next week, I'll probably just make, like, chicken wings or something. Maybe the oven will be the air fryer. We'll see. This is what I, I thought I was going to make it tonight. And I'll make it tomorrow. Um, French lamb rack. Hello. Baby, I'm going to make me some lamb chops. Okay. Pricey. Pricey. And it better be delish, okay? Make me a nice little dinner, solo dinner, okay? Have myself a romantic evening. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Period. Material girl. Um, Alright. What else did I get? Um... I got this shrimp fried rice, this spicy Thai shrimp fried rice. It sounds really good. Um, oh, the shrimp is already in here. I'm stupid. Ugh, cause this has add a, a thing of shrimp and I thought I had to get my own shrimp. Yo, I keep forgetting Trader Joe's. One thing about Trader Joe's, when they give you like these frozen meals, it comes with everything that you need. So I bought shrimp that I didn't need to buy, so. At least I have shrimp, you know, for whenever I, uh, whenever I need it. Cool, 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 cool. And then I'm trying out a new chicken sausage. It's just spicy jalapenos. Um, jalapeno. And I also got pollo asada autentico, which is basically already seasoned, uh, chicken breast. So this is for those quick days. I just want to throw something on a, the, the, um, on the oven or bake it and I'm busy. Like I need more of those meals around. Cause child, I don't always wanna order out. And I'm like, dang, I don't always wanna cook, cook either, right? Hey. All right, so I got some more salad mixes. Um, Baby, them damn dresses from Trader Joe's are so good. Child, let me tell you how, like two nights ago, um, I was hungry, but I was getting ready to go out to eat. So I didn't want to have a whole meal, but I had some leftover lettuce. I was trying to finish. I just put a little bit of that dressing on it. When I told I was eating the lettuce like with my head, like it was so good. <laughs> no, it was a Trader Joe's dressing actually. It was, oh no, it wasn't. It was this one from Amazon Fresh. Is it Amazon Fresh or Whole Foods? Basically the 365 brand is so organic, lemon, ginger, turmeric, vinaigrette. Like it's so freaking good. Ugh. Listen, I don't know what ranch is anymore. I had bought this the last time I did my Trader Joe's haul, but these go bad really fast. So I literally had to like meal plan and like plan to eat this because I was like, dang, I pulled it out today and I was like, is that mold on it already? Yeesh. There's only four in here. I'm gonna make these for like lunch or whatever. Oh, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna chop up like the chicken sausage and like pan fry it add some vegetables and stuff um like some peppers onions mm, and maybe i'll put some of that salad in there Ooh, and then i'll have them in like in the pita bread that sounds like a good lunch right does it mm. i just randomly started thinking about tacos and i don't know why but i feel like that sounds good too Okay, let's go. Um, I got these jerk style plantain chips. I don't know what the hell Trader Joe's think they know about jerk style anything. So I was like, this bird tastes like chicken. Hey guys, um, happy Sunday. <laughs> um, I have been working on my vlog that is uploading now, taking forever. Ugh, you know, one thing when I moved from this place. I'm looking forward to having faster internet. Like, that's for sure. Faster internet. Okay. So, I am getting ready to make some diner. Girl, the camera's trying to tussle. Um... There we go. Oh, it's a cork, baby. Oh, it's a cork. A cork. Let me start enjoying my birthday now because my period is supposed to come this week, which means 
Am I gonna enjoy my birthday week? Absolutely not. <laughs> Am I going to hate it? Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> in here I'm gonna try it I'm gonna try it because um I don't think I'm gonna save any of this Prosecco Rosé you know what I'm gonna pop open my hookah oh I'm gonna vibe out is it giving solo date night oh we love to see it period oh I'm gonna pop open a hookah And that's all fitting the whole bottle in your glass. Y'all, they didn't lie. Tonight's gonna be a good night. Tonight's gonna be a good, good night. Tonight's gonna be a good night. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, that's cute. Oh, okay. Come on, Trader Joe's. Uh, Prosecco Rosé. Oh. 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 11% alcohol. Oh. Mmm. Italian sparkling wine. Okay, well, <laughs> happy birthday to me. Oh. Mmm. I actually have a couple, um, I have two hookah thingies. I think they all use a big one today. I don't even feel like I don't do the small one right. And I don't have none of my hookah connoisseurs here with me. <laughs> so we're gonna start with the big one then, cause I, with the big daddy. But then with, when I use big daddy, I really gotta like clean it out. Um, shout out to everybody that, that doesn't clean out their hookahs. Y'all nasty. <laughs> Y'all nasty. Dang, I haven't taken this out since my last game night. <sighs> I have all these games in here that should not be in here. I'm not gonna lie, I'm gonna have to call in some reinforcements, but I think I'm gonna be good. I'm a girl that just sits pretty while everybody else has the hookah. <laughs> Pass me, I'm done. <laughs> but I think I can't do nothing, like, Kind of tragic. So the Shisha goes in here. No. Yeah, Shisha goes in here. Cole goes in here. And you cover it like this. Um, this is the lights. Yo, did I ever get this to work? No, nah, I want all the vibes tonight. I want all the vibes. Bam! Uh, 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 uh. Yes! Hold on. I should be on my big daddy lights, but I'm gonna chill, just do my small one. Cause it's just me, you know? I'm just chilling. Why you guys are doing one? How about turning it on? Why is it not turning on? <laughs> not y'all trying to mess up my vibe tonight. Not tonight. Not tonight.
And I'm acting like I know what I'm doing. Mm -hmm. Come on now. Kid, because I swear I don't know what I'm doing wrong. If y'all knew the struggle that it took to get this hookah together, listen. <laughs> I had to call reinforcements. I have come on a line. I was texting people like, "Yo, finally got it popping." I said, "It's the last try." Finally. Anyways, girl, I crushed that pizza so fast. <laughs> I crushed that pizza in my frustration. Mm. Didn't even show y'all, but it was so good. It was basically cheesy bread with pesto on it. But it was really good. It was like $5 at Trader Joe's. Um, but yeah, so I'm gonna kick you, my girl. I'm gonna take a nice, hot, bath tonight luxuriate in the water i'm paying for and call it a night so thank you guys so much for watching and i'm see you on the next one <laughs> Toodles. <laughs>